Another day of cleaning up in Round Rock has come to an end. The community came together to help clean up the city after an EF2 tornado ripped through on Monday. Some volunteers came from outside of Round Rock to help pitch in. CBS Austin's Ricardo Lewis is joining us live from Round Rock, one of the hardest hit neighborhoods. Ricardo, neighbors say they are still in shock tonight. Yeah, homeowners say that they are shocked that something like this can even happen. They still have tears falling down their faces, but they do know that they have a strong community standing right behind them. Dozens of people turned out in these communities today, rolling up their sleeves and stepping in to clean up. We have the biggest support system that I've ever seen in my life. The Round Rock community is coming together for another day of cleaning to help neighbors after a powerful EF2 tornado left behind a trail of destruction. It's really kind of nice to see the community come together like this. You know, we've watched these things happen over in Ukraine, and I think we're kind of seeing some of the same things happen here. The community assembling for a common good. Volunteers spent the day clearing debris and tree limbs from the homes severely impacted in the Kensington Place and Windy Park neighborhoods. We came out here day one after the tornado and our primary focus was to bring in U-Hauls and as many runners as we could. Runner City is purchasing storage units for families to have a safe space to store their belongings. They started with $5,000 that quickly ran out, but donors are stepping in to help. There's still a lot of people out here that don't know where they're going to go, that don't have any money to get there. And so that's why we're here. We're going to try to do everything we can and we're not going to leave anybody behind. People from near and far are helping rebuild this community. Humberto Flores drove in all the way from Chicago. We just came in and just was like, how do we mobilize people and get them going to see if we can get people to come and help? Volunteers just thankful no lives were lost. They'll be here until Round Rock is put back together. All the stuff we can replace, lives we can't replace. Now, several organizations are stepping in to help along with the city for a disaster relief fund for those tornado victims. Applications are expected to go out within the next few days. A lot of people stepping in to help tonight. Live in Round Rock, Ricardo Lewis, CBS Austin News.